it's time to get up. Time to get up. What time do you wake up? I wake up at 10.30 every morning. And why do you wake up at 10.30? Because I go to bed at 2 and 3 a.m. And my aunt tells me, you can wake up at 10.30. That's the latest. Period. Period. Okay. So you wake up and then what do you do? I play on my phone. So I, I get on my telephono. I stay on here for like 20 minutes going through all the apps. Instagram, look at all the cute people. TikTok, find all the funny videos. And then I just vibe. Okay. And then I'll pull the covers off and go downstairs. And why do you go downstairs? To eat some breakfast and say hello to my lovely aunt and uncle. Let's see it. Erin normally is in trouble for something in the morning. Erin's usually in trouble because she woke up late. Is usually what Either it is. I woke up past 10.30, I told you guys my aunt only lets me sleep till 10.30, or I didn't do something the night before. Only till 10.30. Only till 10.30. I need like 12.30, the latest. And what do you think? The for early. breakfast? Usually, since I wake up at 10.30 and I'll spend like maybe 20 something minutes on my phone. I'll either eat breakfast or lunch, depends on my mood, since I'm kind of in that time frame where I'm like, brunch, brunch, which one do I want? So usually, watch yourself, oh, watch yourself. Usually I'll just fix something like cereal or make a PB and J. Usually since we got a bunch of fruit for quarantine, I usually like to eat some fruit in the morning. You either got your oranges, strawberries, mango, Pineapple. So today, she's going with the strawberries. That is Tyler's lunch. That finished. Cause it's lunch time. Tight. Girl didn't even wash a strawberry. I washed them before. She did. She washed them all. Mm. This is actually really good. So Aaron really does normally nibble on something, and then we'll do lunch. So what do you do after the strawberries? Usually. I'll see if I have any chores for my aunt and uncle to do in the morning. But if I don't have any, then I'll go upstairs and get ready for the day. What is going on with this phone case? I was painting it. Like not activity. <laughs> Aaron always had some arts and crafts going on. I wash my face since the night before. I probably moisturize the zit cream, so I want all that off. Oh my god, I'm out of breath. And then I just put my hair back, cause you know, I don't want it to get wet. Cause I blow dry it. Usually if I wash my hair, Laura will be helpful to me and she'll blow dry my hair so I can keep it like that for the next couple days. <laughs> and don't have to deal with the poofiness. Let's see the face wash we're using today. Ooh, okay. Make it some water. Let me wash. I'm like out of breath. <sighs> <laughs> Running up them stairs, man. How do they get you? I don't know how. your face is washed oh I actually brushed my teeth I didn't brush you know I usually don't brush my teeth right away since I eat breakfast and stuff and then I just like to do a little scrub a dub dub so I don't have stinky breath all throughout the day okay. this toothpaste is charcoal so it's gonna come out black so don't be like <gasps> what is that yeah, so don't be where did you get this store you must have threw it in the cart <laughs> I really like it so we like to scrub a dub dub. Okay, I want to see your teeth. What? Okay. I didn't know 
Merry Christmas made that. Wow. I know. I thought it was just like weird brand. Yeah. And that's actually part of the routine. You have to dance while brushing your teeth. Yeah. Alright, so in case you guys were wondering what I used for zit cream, I used the Kate Somerville Radicate little acne treatment. It's like a spot treatment? Mm hmm. It helps. Alright. But for today's moisturizer, Moist. I'm gonna be using the Drunk Elephant little eye serum to moisturize underneath those eyes. I think it got too much actually. Oh, yeah. I put it on my eyelids, too. Yeah, me, too. Up to my brows. Feels good, huh? Oh, God. I definitely put too much. Oh, no. Regrets. Regrets. Regrets, people. All right. All right. And then for the face moisturizer, I'm going to be using the milk. Mm, vegan milk moisturizer. It's really nice. It's probably good for daytime because it's a little lighter, huh? Yeah. It's really thick. Oh shoot. Yeah. But it's like nice. Okay. She lives. I live for it. You want to show me your plants? I'll show them my plants. Alright. So here's one baby. Oh. Doing pretty good. Yeah. Here's the other one. Oh, she looks happy. Yeah, she's doing pretty good right now. I'm trying to make sure they get enough sun. And don't tell the others, but this is my favorite. Oh, Aaron, what is on your wall? I have no clue. You're going to get in trouble. It's nothing. <laughs> but these are my babies. They used to be right here. Look how much they've grown. I know. I'm so proud of them. Hey. I know, I know, but it's hard not to. <laughs> All right. What's the next move? Usually if I'm outside or it's like sunny, I'll use this little Glossier. And it's just like a daily sunscreen type of thing. Just I love that. It. I actually have used that and it's a great product. It is great. All right, so I don't get dressed every day, but I like to get dressed like maybe three times out of the week just so I feel spazzed up and I'm not wearing pajamas all the time. Smells like So you change from, are you gonna get dressed today? I'm gonna get dressed. Oh, this is new. Is that shade? <laughs> all right. You could wear the same t-shirt, it'd be cute. I definitely am. Yeah. I usually wear my pajama shirts since they're just big t-shirts. Yeah, me too. I normally wear the clothes I slept in all day. It's just, it just pops. Yes. Get some socks. Erin, have you seen the Jesus? No. I, I don't know where they are. Haven't seen them. Okay, just wondering. This is her hardest decision of the day. Hey, you stop it. The old sock drawer. You leave my socks alone. You realize no one will see you today but us. Okay, well, you know what? I want to spill, feel spazzed up. You know what? I might not just do so. Okay. Jen doesn't move. She scares us sometimes. We're like, are you afraid then? She just is a lazy girl. She's older. She doesn't like to interact that much these days. She used to, but she's just getting old, aren't you, baby? She just likes to sleep nowadays. Yeah. Look at that eye. She said, I see you. <laughs> I see y'all. You're not slick. She went with socks. I went with socks. Put pants All on. that time for some black hangs her way socks. Hey, you stop. It's a complicated choice. All right. Got a bra, got some socks, and got some jeans on. I feel pretty formal. All right, after your dress, we go back into the bathroom. We go back into the bathroom. I brush the ends of my hair just so they don't look as ratty-tatty. Mm -hmm. Look more clean, I guess you would say. 
If you see little white specks of white in my hair, that would be paint. We don't know how it got in there, but it did. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Now that I let the moisturizer sit in for a bit, I like to just put on a little bit of light makeup. Since it is quarantine, I'm not going to put on much. Just a little bit of concealer to hide up a little bit of the redness and bumps. And that's really all I do. This is the Glossier Concealer, and this is the shade Medium. It's really nice if you just want a little light coverage. And then, I'm going to get into a little bit of lip gloss. Laneige. Laneige. This is Pear. This is, like, one of the best. That's just on period. Usually I would put on a little bit of mascara, but since I'm trying to let my lashes grow out and get better, I don't do much. But I will go ahead and move on to my brows. I just get the Milk Kush Clear Brow Gel. I just do that a little bit to help make my brows more fluffy. That's all I do. So since I'm going to be spending some time in my bedroom doing some schoolwork, this week is spring break. So I actually don't have any schoolwork, but I'm just showing you guys what I usually do. And since I am spending time up here, I'm just going to light a candle. As you can see, I still have my LED lights on so I can just be all relaxed and vibing. So yeah, now I just get my school Chromebook and usually I just go to work at that. So what are we working on today? Uh, today we will be going to Google Classroom. Google Classroom. And you got some assignments? Mm. <laughs> well, I actually do. <laughs> do you? Yeah, it's just this uh, project I need to get finished by Saturday. And then I need to do my workouts for swim. And then that's it. Alright. So it's not that much. But usually I'll be packed, especially with English. My English Oof. teacher loves giving me assignments in math, chemistry, Spanish, which is pretty easy, and sometimes drawing. So it's not that difficult. Look at my smart girl. Oh, don't look at that. It's probably wrong. <laughs> So that's really all I do for my morning routine during quarantine. There's not much for us to do since we are at home, but usually during the nighttime, me and my family after dinner will play board games like Catan, Clue, Uno, and stuff. I like to draw, paint. Right now I'm painting a phone case instead of paying $40 for, for a phone case. I'll let you guys know how that goes. I like to play Minecraft and Mario Kart. I play Minecraft by myself, but I play Mario Kart with the fam, hang out with the cats, hang out with the fam, and that's really it. We like to play in the backyard ping pong. Oh, uh, we like to play ping pong. We actually just like to sit outside and like... We do. And like we just vibe. Lie down. We vibe in the sun, but it's rainy today. Yeah, but that's a vibe too. Oh, sometimes I like to make TikToks, I'll post things on Instagram, anything to keep me busy. That's it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching my morning routine during quarantine. I love you guys and I'll see you in my next video.